All right, so we're uh, going to take a moment to introduce you to the newest member of Team Audio Nerds and uh, the newest employee of Audio Nerds, George uh, Ellis Graham, Graham the, thir the second, the second, or it's like we like to call him Ezel. What brings you to Audio Nerds, Ezel? Say what? I said, what brings you to Audio Nerds? Let's see, Audio Nerds is the best, sir. <laughs> Team Audio Nerds but the win. See, see, he's already got his game plan. Got a little surprise here today. Just got an order in from uh, D Digital Designs there. And I got a nice amp here for the Ranger here. It's the DDS2B. It's a big bitch here, man. Seems how I hate unboxing videos. We're uh, gonna do an unboxing video. I absolutely hate unboxing videos. How I ironic. Care. I don't care how it's packaged, it made it safely. <laughs> it guy. should make it safely. The UPS guy was nice enough. Uh, <laughs> I don't read manuals. Oh, Look man. at this sexy bitch right here. Oh, man. oh, you don't do unboxing videos, but yet you have a boner. I get it. Size of an like 1350 it. by two. You like it? Big. I think the, 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 the I think the stats on that thing are 1350 by two, yeah. if I'm not mistaken. 1350 by two. Here's it in comparison with my 8K. In comparison to the Crossfire 8K. Yeah, right look at what we got there. This is our Mizzen High amp now. So for everybody who always asks, oh, why your Mizzen High sounds so good? Spend the money, get yourself a fucking good amp, okay? Only thing that I can say. Now let's crack it open and uh, see some guts here. This should be interesting. Huh? Oh, fuck that box, man. You need a screwdriver, sir. Oh. So we got all the screws out here, and we're about to look at the guts of this thing right here. I took it off. <laughs> look at this right here. Look at that. Signal look side completely separated. Look at that. Looks like they purposely made it further away from the uh, yeah the input side. So for all you guys wanting to get mids and highs lob, please spend the money on the amplifier. Please. Hey, down, baby. DDS2B. Been kind of a busy week. Lanzar. Crossfire lineup. A couple of them at least. Ran, ran, random. JL Audio. 360 slash 4. What is this? Oh, yeah, that linear. Old linear power. <coughs> Damn. This thing's from. What did it say? Uh, let's see. 1990. Shit. It shows you how to hook it up at the bottom. Old Molex plug. Yeah. The DD lineup, of course. The DD. DD. Crossfire C5, C3, etc. You know, the works. Cheapo C5. Well, can't knock them. They're okay, though. <coughs> oh, my favorite amp of the day, or the week, rather. DD S5. Five channel. Let me see. Just back on that. Sexy, sexy. Oh yeah, this thing is all in one. Go on anything. Oh yeah. Yeah. Good stuff. Let's put these guys on. Oh. But grab my drink first. Oh fuck I put it. Yeah. Fries. Fries. Oh. Huh. Yo, I saw fucking. He was that motherfucker ran like a 
fuck 140, man. <laughs> fucking stupid, man. He nigga had slave feet. To this day, I, to this day, I think he still has the fastest time clock. Yeah. Yeah. And I used to like wonder how's he good because he can't tackle. Yeah. He but really like the ball's like thrown in the air, he's standing over there, and he's already over there. Mm -hmm. You know? Yeah. <laughs> Judge. Oh yeah. I was gonna cut the rest of the shit off. And he had a vertical like that. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. Good old school. Don't know how old school. Crossfire component set. It's the FS 100.2. Wait, when you go pick up on Crossfire. Look nice. Very old school. Very. I'm gonna pick this one up. Oh, four incher. Oh man. From what I understand, they sound great. So. Plus it's crossfire, so you can't go wrong. Crossover right here. Made in USA. Maybe. Maybe. I'll take the word for it. Uh well, no, it's gotta be made here. <coughs> oh man. Night. Late, late night. Let's throw hair over here. Just uh relaxing. I'm over here fucking tweaking all kinds of shit. Ooh, fucking jitterbug. Fucking red line for the win. <laughs> Red line! Uh, over there. Right over yonder. Just get one from the wall. Okay. Got all the pieces for the beamer box. Plus the port. Plus that. Plus that. Plus that. Random beamer wheel. Uh, that's where the box is going. Yep. 7.45 outside. And it's about uh, 12 30 ish. We have a complete box. Uh, port side, stone painted. Nice and pretty. Same thing on this side. If you're wondering why, we're going to just carpet this whole thing over here. All the way around. Yeah, just all the way around. Anyway, yeah. Still tweaking, by the way. I blame this. Oh, fucking red line, extreme. So those remnants. Oh. Hold on. Ah, happy day for Mr. O'Hara. Yeah, happy, happy day. You got my package from Nate. Excessive amperage for the win here. Excessive amperage green. With the monster stud here. The patented monster stud. Is it patented? No, I don't think it's patented, but it's a damn good idea. <laughs> Holy shit. Ugh, tight clearance there. I'm going to do some shit to keep that off there. I don't know. I don't need no mishaps. Sand it down or what? Hmm? Sand it down? No, I'm just worried about it coming over and hitting right there. Oh yeah, brought my uh, alternator in too. You take yours out? No, I, I brought it with me. Oh, okay. Oh, your uh, factory one? Yeah, I need to take that one out, put the new one, or take the new one out, put the old one back in. Okay, <laughs> fuck your factory head unit. I don't care that your AC controls are in it or hey, what the sir. fuck ever else. It's hey. gonna sound like shit. Hey, sir. The Scion has factory pre out, sir. How do you feel about that? It's still a fucking factory radio. It still sounds like shit. And fuck a Bit One, fuck a Moscone, fuck a uh, hey, whatever the fuck audio control. LC1, what the fuck sir. ever. LC1. Fuck it. This is what people want. That's sorry. what the people want, yeah. This You're making a fucking mistake. Wants, man. You're making a fucking mistake. Hey. Everybody's making a fucking mistake. Get an aftermarket fucking hand unit. Be a man. Sir, it's six hundred dollars. It's gotta be good. Yeah, this factory system cost me an extra thirty five hundred dollars. Yeah. You just paid thirty five hundred dollars just for somebody to stick it right in your asshole, not even good. They, they missed the prostate altogether. They just scratched your colon with the fingernail. That's all that happened. Nothing good. Fuck a line out converter. Sir. Fuck it. It's Friday. What the fuck is this? Friday. That is an iPod 
uh, module for a PRS 880 from like 2006 or something. We have the King of Flex. Hard it again. Getting it. Stepping up his mids and highs game. Let's see what we got here. Got the DDB2s with some uh, Crossfire XS 8s or M8s. Got three DAD 15s on the two DB Drive Platinum 2000s. This bitch is banging now. New Eclipse 8 volt. Got some top line uh, RCAs here and a DDSS4 for his new mids and highs. So uh, no more 6.9s hanging from the roof. No more fuckery. Fucking around. Fuck, fuck, fucking around. This bitch is banging now. He gets some mids and highs to match it. Me and Jose are getting our challenger on. Radio installs for the win. Two man radio installs for the win. Let's see. Protein shit. Yeah. This thing's brand new, by the way. It smells pretty. Are you ready? We've been fucking ass at getting footage lately of anything. So, uh, let's take this quick moment here. What's your name? 560. Uh, it should be right over here. I took it off probably in this general area. But, uh, give us a Zillow's truck. It says the vampire is 300 amp. Externally regulated. Modelo. Here's the enclosure. A little floor for it. Floating amp rack. Uh, JVC double bin, alarm start. Got everything cleared out to get started on here. Got a battery box in the back we're working on. Kinetics there. Um, you know, the customer's car here. Some actuators alarm. And uh, I'm about to kick over a booster. So, anyway, trying to grab as much footage as we can because we've been slacking. We've been so damn busy. Any closing words? Far little clip here because we've been sucking ass getting footage. And whose fault is it? It's okay, sir. It's fine. Let's figure your bus bars real quick as a closing. Very nice, Jose. Holding we'll bus bars. So apparently, I haven't been getting any footage. Apparently, sir. Why is that? So we've been too busy working on Drake's truck. That fucking guy over there. So I haven't had a chance to listen to Let's his. Go. Upgraded. Shit. Because his had to be I done. Appreciate, oh, I appreciate plenty. <laughs> you see me with the smile when I pulled in, right? I can't stop smiling every time I play that thing. All right. It's fucking gay cheese, bro. Who's first then? First to demo? Oh, Kush. Kush. No, Kush gave it to the, the, the new guy, the rookie. Hey, that alarm sucks ass, by the way. <laughs> you get your big boy mowing on that bitch. Fuck that. I have donkey here. Hey, can I have a little power to you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I only have 500 watts. Just so everybody can see what's going on. I don't know. You put tennis balls in the back? Yeah. This fucking guy. What? Uh, I would show you the battery rack, but he's got it locked. Yeah, yeah. DD3500s set up created by yours truly and a couple others. I said set up created by yours truly with the help of others. You weren't here for the whole install, sir. You're here for the box. The box is yours.
gonna be another long night here, audio nerds. As you can see, we're closed. Not really, but we're still here. <sighs> DD twenty five or yeah, twenty five tens coming for a customer, and then. Uh, Got three little surprises for me right there. But we'll get to that later. You know, wait. We have tonight's crew. It's about time to grab a fucking video camera and get some of the shit we can do around here. What? <laughs> oh, for everybody who doesn't know, this is the newest member of the Audio Nerds team here. Ezel. Ezel is a employee slash <laughs> the horn's going. Ruben's out there. Alright, so what we got going on here tonight is uh, it's 10 o'clock and we gotta um, make a couple boxes. A couple. I don't think Jose's ready. Zell's ready. He was born ready. Yeah. I don't mean to talk trash. I'm just playing. I don't know. Anyway, let's run around. First, first one we got going on here. This is an isobaric fourth order bandpass two to one ratio for two DD 25s, 25 10s. Seems a little crazy, but I've done this several times and it works out very well. Basically, I have two woofers, only enough space for one, but I need some output and some power handling and some bandwidth. That's the way to go. Uh, what are you, Jose, you're fucking holding this shit gonna be done? Be like that, sir? How did it go to you? Anyway. How does your wife like you? She just does. I guess there's some money for everybody, right? Hey, that's all right. I'll give them back for you later, Wade. I'll crop dust his ass. No, fuck that. So you did crop dust his ass well, yesterday. Was like, <laughs> <laughs> How much do you hate me right now? I don't really care for you. <laughs> Damn. I try to make you a star. Brian tries to make you a star, and you don't listen. The king of fights listened, and guess what? Why are you dragging me into shit? He's a star. See? Now you're in it, sir. By default, anyway, right? Roger, shut the fuck up. That's what he's done. Wait, picks a shit. He's out. Why do you look like you belong in Bone Thugs and Harmony? <laughs> you look like lazy. <laughs> I'm lazy, bro. You look like lazy, sir. Yeah, a haircut, sir. This is why you cannot get. You're a half breed, though, man. <laughs> you should be able to like, play that shit to a T. You know what uh, he needs to do? What? He cut his hair. He it do is it. Christmas here at Audio Nerds, and I fucking cut you. It's a great day today. Got mine. Brian got his. How come yours look bigger than mine? When well, actuality, mine's bigger than yours in real life. Oh, I was about to say, <laughs> to say sir. Uh, I have something to tell you. It's fine. We're about the same. It's all fine. It's all fine, sir. We'll have a pull out and press later. Mine are already out. Get to it, sir. I'm anxiously I know you were, uh, waiting for this. Big announcement though. Shout out to Roger at Crossfire. We were once Crossfire dealers. We had a little bit of separation. We had a tip. We had a tip, yeah. <laughs> but uh, I need a drill. We both know oh, fuck. what's good for us here. Fucking batteries. But we are an authorized Crossfire dealer. Just authorized. Anybody wants to know anybody needs anything? Authorized. Wait on that drill, Ezel. He just got back there. Fuck, he's taking too long. <laughs> Fuck, man. I think it's short shirt Wednesday. I like that. <laughs> sure. raise, your, raise your arm, sir. I don't pass the shirt to him. Oh, no, no. <laughs> Stay out the belly button. <laughs> Stay out the belly button. Oh, <sighs> we got hit today. 
I ain't gonna open one of these packages in a while. Oh, this box looks familiar though. I think I know where it came from. <laughs> You're the snaking suspicion. Uh oh. Uh, five. Oh, this Nevada. Put that bitch up there, man. Oh my god. No, that's a man's woofer. Look at that beast. Pure sexiness. You gotta decimate all, sir. Chipping a little. That's a man's woofer, sir. Does Kush have a double baffle? Yeah. He does? Okay. Damn. Shit's about to get real.